Pedrasek is a Czech former professional footballer who played as a goalkeeper and current ice hockey player who plays as a goaltender for Oxford City Stars. He has been described as one of the greatest goalkeepers of all time, and, by some, as the greatest goalkeeper, alongside Peter Schmeichel, in Premier League history. Sek began his senior career at Kmol Blusani in 1999, where he played sporadically for two seasons prior to relocating to Sparta Prague in 2001. At age 19, Sek became a first-team regular, and his single campaign with the club saw him register a league record of not conceding a goal in 903 competitive minutes. This led to his first move abroad, when he relocated to France to join Ligue 1 side ran for a fee of 5.5 million euros, 3.9 million pounds, in 2002. In France, Sec starred in an underperforming team, and was the subject of a then-club record transfer for a goalkeeper when he moved to Premier League side Chelsea for a fee of £7 million, 9.8 million euros, in 2004. In his 11-year spell at Chelsea, Sec made 494 appearances in all competitions, making him the club's seventh most capped player of all time. He also helped the club win four Premier League titles, four FA Cups, three League Cups, one UEFA Champions League title, and one UEFA Europa League title. Sec also holds Chelsea's all-time record for clean sheets, with 228. 21 Sec departed Chelsea in 2015 to join City rivals Arsenal for a fee of £10 million, where he won another FA Cup before retiring in 2019. A Czech international, Sec made his debut with the Czech Republic in 2002, and is the most capped player in the history of the Czech national team, with 124 caps. He represented his country at the 2006 World Cup, as well as the 2004, 2008, 2012, and 2016 European Championships. He was voted into the Euro 2004 All-Star team after helping the Czechs reach the semi-finals, and served as the team's captain, prior to retiring from international competition in 2016. Sek also holds the record for the most Czech footballer of the year and Czech Golden Ball wins. Sek holds a number of goalkeeping records, including the Premier League record for fewest appearances required to reach 100 clean sheets, having done so in 180 appearances, the most clean sheets in a season, 24, as well as the record for the most clean sheets in Premier League history, 202. Sek is also the only goalkeeper to have won the Premier League Golden Glove with two separate clubs, and has won it a joint record four times, in the 2004, 05, 2009 10, 2013 14, and the 2015 16 seasons. He was voted the IFS World's Best Goalkeeper in 2005 received the award of best goalkeeper in the 2004, 05, 2006, 07 and 2007, 08 editions of the UEFA Champions League, and went 1,025 minutes without conceding a goal in the 2004, 05 season, a league record. A he has the third most clean sheets since 2000 among all goalkeepers. Club career. Sek started playing football aged 7 for Skoda Plzen, later known as Victoria Plzen. In his early days, he played as a striker, although he moved to the goalkeeper position after breaking his leg at age 10. Sek joined Czech first league team Kmol Blusani in June 1999 and made his league debut at the age of 17 in October 1999, in a 3-1 loss against Sparta. Sek signed a five-and-a-half-year contract with Sparta Prague at the age of 18 in January 2001, although he remained at Blusani until the end of the 2000-01 season. In November 2001, Sek broke the record formerly held by Theodore Rayman for the longest time elapsed without conceding a goal in the Czech Professional League, stretching his run to 855 minutes. His clean sheet record finally ended when he was beaten by a goal from Marcel Malecki of Bohemians on November 17, 2001, ending his record at 903 consecutive minutes without conceding. Despite Sek not winning the league title in the spring of 2002 with Sparta, 
he attracted interest from English clubs including Arsenal due to his international performances. Due to difficulties in obtaining a work permit, however, a proposed deal with the Gunners fell through. At Rennes. In July 2002, Sec moved to French club Rennes, signing a four-year contract for a transfer fee reported as CZK 150 million, 5.5 million euros. During his first season in France, he was awarded man of the match against Paris Saint-Germain by L'Equipe. In May 2003, Ren was at the bottom of the league table, yet escaped relegation with a win over Montpellier in the final matchday. At Chelsea. Chelsea made a transfer bid for SEC in January 2004 which was rejected. However in February Ren agreed to SEC as move to Chelsea for £7 million. SEC signed a five-year contract, to commence in July 2004, becoming the most expensive goalkeeper in Chelsea's history at that time. Sekas was one of many British club transfers that came under the spotlight in the 2006 football corruption investigation for being potentially in breach of transfer regulations. The Stevens Inquiry Report, published in June 2007, found no evidence of illegal payments. Golden Glove, back-to-back -back Premier League wins. Sek was quiet but when he did speak, everyone listened. Whenever the captain, John Terry, or the other leaders didn't know quite what to say, that's when he stepped up and took charge. He was one of those characters that I don't think anyone could dislike. He's humble, incredibly gifted, and works incredibly hard. You couldn't fall out with him even if you tried. Robert Huth, on sex character and leadership skills. When Sec arrived at Chelsea, Carlo Cuticini was already established as Chelsea's first choice goalkeeper. Cuticini, however, suffered a pre-season elbow injury that allowed Chelsea manager Jose Mourinho to promote Sec into the starting spot, where he became the first choice goalkeeper in his first season. He kept a clean sheet in his Premier League debut in a 1-0 victory over Manchester United. On March 5, 2005, Sec set a new Premier League record of 1,025 minutes without letting in a goal, though his record was later broken by Manchester United's Edwin van der Sar. Sec finally conceded to Leon McKenzie of Norwich City, after keeping a clean sheet in the league since December 12, 2004 when Thierry Henry scored for Arsenal. Sec was given a special award by the Premier League for the new record, and he was also awarded the Premier League Golden Glove at the end of the 2004-05 season for keeping a record 24 clean sheets in the Premier League. Chelsea retained the Premier League title in the 2005-06 season, with Sec playing in 34 league matches. Chelsea conceded just 22 times during the season. In January 2006, he was named the IFS world's best goalkeeper for 2005. In February 2006, Sec signed a two-year contract extension, keeping him at the club until 2010. He was also named the Czech Footballer of the Year for the first time. Sec underwent minor shoulder surgery on June 27, 2006 to repair a long-standing injury stemming from the previous season. He returned to action on August 27, 2006. Sek sustained a head injury in the match against Reading at the Maidech Ski Stadium on October 14, 2006 when he collided with Reading midfielder Stephen Hunt inside Chelsea's penalty area within the first minute of a Premier League match. Hunt's right knee hit Sek's head, leaving the goalkeeper requiring treatment. Sek was taken off after several minutes and replaced by Carlo Cuticini, who himself was knocked unconscious later in the same game, forcing Chelsea captain John Terry to play in goal for the match's remaining minutes. Sec underwent surgery for a depressed skull fracture. Initially unaware of the seriousness of the injury, the doctors later reported that it nearly cost Sec his life, and as a result of the collision, he suffered intense headaches. Chelsea went on to win the match 1-0. Chelsea manager Jose Mourinho blamed Hunt for Seca's injury, saying that his challenge was a disgrace. He also criticised the South Central Ambulance Service and match referee Mike Riley. A number of commentators, including current and former goalkeepers, 
saw the incident as highlighting the need for greater protection for goalkeepers. Sec was able to return home on October 24, 2006 and participated in light training the following week. Chelsea, however, announced that the goalkeeper would be out for three months, in line with medical advice on the time needed for complete recovery from the skull fracture. In an interview, Sec said that he had no memory of the injury itself. Sec made his comeback in a Premier League match in a 2-0 defeat against Liverpool on January 20, 2007, wearing a rugby-style headguard made by Canterbury of New Zealand and carrying the manufacturer's logo. This caused friction with Czech national team sponsor Puma and Chelsea's apparel manufacturer Adidas. The matter was resolved after the latter sponsor developed its own headgear for Sec to wear in club matches, while the player went on to wear an unbranded cap for national team games. Sec wore the head guard for the rest of his career. Although Chelsea lost Sec's comeback match, he then went approximately 810 minutes of Premier League play without conceding a goal. On April 11, 2007, Sec was awarded the Premier League Player of the Month for the first time in his career, in recognition of his eight successive league clean sheets. He was the first goalkeeper to receive the award since Tim Flowers in 2000. This run was ended during a 4-1 Chelsea victory over West Ham United on April 18, 2007 when Carlos Teve scored against him. Sec also kept a clean sheet for Chelsea in the 2007 FA Cup final against Manchester United. He and United's Edwin van der Sar shared the honour of being the first goalkeepers to keep a clean sheet over 90 minutes in a competitive fixture at the new Wembley Stadium, but Sec became the first goalkeeper to end a competitive game unbeaten, as Chelsea beat United 1-0 to win the FA Cup. Sec started the 2007-08 season conceding two goals against Birmingham City in the first match of the season. Despite this, Chelsea managed to win 3-2 and set an English record for their 64th consecutive unbeaten league match at home. In November 2007, Sec suffered an injury to his right calf muscle in the 0-0 UEFA Champions League group stage match at Schalke 04. The following month, on December 23, 2007, he had to be replaced during a match against Blackburn Rovers due to a hip injury. Chelsea suffered their first major blow when they lost the League Cup final to Tottenham Hotspur, with Sec parrying the ball onto Jonathan Woodgate's head for the winner. He played in several games until injuring his ankle in training on the eve of Chelsea's home Champions League tie with Greek champions Olympiakos. In the weeks that followed, Sec missed key games of Chelsea's campaign, including the derby with Arsenal and both legs of the Champions League quarter-final. On April 7, 2008, it was announced that Sec had undergone emergency surgery on his chin and lips following an accidental collision with Tal Benheim during training. He had 50 stitches put on his mouth and chin. He returned to action on April 14, in a home match against Wigan Athletic which Chelsea drew 1-1. He appeared in the Champions League final against Manchester United, where Chelsea lost in a penalty shootout. Sec signed a new five-year contract in July 2008 to keep him at Chelsea until 2013. Chelsea started the 2008-09 season in good form, conceding only seven goals in 17 games and keeping 11 clean sheets, 10 of which with Sec in goal. In November 2008, Chelsea beat Sunderland 5-0 at Stamford Bridge, a game which marked the 100th match Sec had played for Chelsea without conceding a goal. Chelsea had a 1-0 victory over Juventus in the Champions League on his 200th appearance for the club, and he also starred in a 1-0 away victory at Villa Park against Aston Villa, saving from Gabriel Agbon Lahore and Gareth Barry. The following week, Sec helped Chelsea move up to second place in the league by saving from Paul Scharner in the first half against Wigan Athletic at Stamford Bridge, where Chelsea won 2-1. Successive clean sheets by Sec in Chelsea's wins against Portsmouth and Coventry City saw his side consolidate their position in the Premier League whilst progressing into the FA Cup semi-finals. Sec also made saves from Dirk Kut and Xavi Alonso as Chelsea beat Liverpool 3-1 at Anfield in the first leg of the Champions League quarter-final. 
in a crucial Premier League game in April 2009, with Chelsea comfortably leading 4-0 against Bolton Wanderers, Chelsea manager Gus Hiddink took off both Didier Drogba and Frank Lampard only for Bolton to score three late goals which questioned the Chelsea defence, and in particular Sek. Sek, however, responded when he saved a penalty from Mark Noble in Chelsea's 1-0 win at the Bullen ground against West Ham. He also kept a clean sheet in the next game against Barcelona during the Champions League semi-final first leg match. Following a 3-2 win against Sunderland at the Stadium of Light, Sec and Chelsea finished the season with the joint tightest defence in the Premier League along with Manchester United, having conceded just 24 goals over the course of the season. Despite conceding the fastest goal in FA Cup final history, Sec helped Chelsea's 2009 FA Cup final triumph over Everton. Chelsea won 2-1, earning the Czech his seventh trophy at the club. Former Chelsea coach Luis Felipe Scolari accused Sec, Michael Ballack and Drogba of causing his sacking, saying that they did not accept my training methods or my demands. Scolari also said that it stemmed from a row between him and the Czech goalkeeper over the latter's alleged insistence on being given a personal coach. Sec denied the claim saying that he was disappointed with Scolari because never in my life have I had a personal goalkeeping coach. Sec began the 2009-10 season in winning form with Chelsea, beating Manchester United in the Community Shield final at Wembley. With the game level at 2-2 at the end of normal time, Sec saved penalties from Ryan Giggs and Patrice Evra. Sec kept goal for Chelsea in the six-match winning run that opened their season and placed them on top of the Premier League. On September 26, 2009, however, Sec was sent off and at the same time conceded the winning penalty for a trip on Wigan forward Hugo Rodaliga, in the defeat that broke the run and conceded the lead in the league to Manchester United. On February 27, 2010, Sec sustained a calf injury in the Champions League match against Inter Milan. On April 13, Sec kept his 100th Premier League clean sheet for Chelsea, against Bolton. He won his second Premier League Golden Glove award for the season, having kept 17 clean sheets in the Premier League as Chelsea secured a third title. He concluded his season by saving a Kevin Prince Boateng penalty against Portsmouth in the FA Cup final, ensuring that the Blues went on to retain the cup and achieve their first domestic double. During 2010-11 pre-season training, Sec re-aggravated the calf injury he suffered against Inter the previous season. Scans revealed a muscle tear that sidelined him for the next three weeks, including Chelsea's 3-1 loss to Manchester United in the Community Shield. He returned on August 14 and kept a clean sheet as Chelsea beat West Bromwich Albion 6-0. Sec then kept another clean sheet in a 2-0 win over Arsenal, before keeping a clean sheet in a 0-0 draw at Villa Park. On March 7, Sec made his 300th Chelsea appearance, against Premier League side Blackpool, which Chelsea went on to win 3-1. On May 19, Sec was awarded the Chelsea Player of the Year for the first time. More than 28,000 fans voted for the award, which was handed over by Chelsea manager Carlo Ancelotti. Sec started the opening game of Chelsea's 2011-12 Premier League season away to Stoke City, which ended 0-0. On August 18, 2011, Sec was ruled out for up to four weeks after he sustained a knee injury in training. He made his return three weeks later against Sunderland in which Chelsea won 2-1. He kept a clean sheet in Chelsea's first Champions League match of the season in a 2-0 win over Bayer Leverkusen. On February 27, Sec was announced as the Czech Footballer of the Year for 2011, winning the award for the fifth time. On March 24, Sec played his 250th league game for Chelsea against Tottenham Hotspur in a 0-0 draw at Stamford Bridge. Sec saved a penalty in extra time against former teammate Arjen Robin, and two penalties in the subsequent penalty shootout, of the 2012 Champions League final against Bayern Munich resulting in the first Champions League win for Chelsea. Sec was named the fans man of the match following his heroic performance in goal for the Blues. By winning the Champions League, 
Sek became just the fourth Czech to win the competition. He finished the season by signing a new four-year contract with Chelsea in May, keeping him with the club until the end of the 2015-16 season. Sek started in Chelsea's first match of the 2012-13 season, the 2012 Community Shield against Manchester City, but failed to keep a clean sheet as Chelsea went down 3-2 to goals from Yaya Toure, Carlos Tevez and Samir Nasri. He also featured in the last UEFA Super Cup to be played at Monaco State Louis II, in which he conceded four goals as Chelsea lost 4-1 to to the UEFA Europa League winners Atletico Madrid. In October 2012, Sek took the captain's armband as regular Chelsea captain John Terry was sidelined with a four-match ban. In May 2013, Sec won the UEFA Europa League when Chelsea defeated Benfica 2-1 in the final. On October 19, 2013, Sec made his 300th Premier League appearance for Chelsea, in a 4-1 home win over newly promoted side Cardiff City. On January 11, 2014, he kept his 209th clean sheet for Chelsea in all competitions in a 2-0 away win at Hull City beating the club record set by Peter Benetti. On March 18, 2014, Sek made his 100th UEFA Champions League appearance in a 2-0 win over Galatasaray at Stamford Bridge. He became the fourth goalkeeper to make a century of appearances in the competition after Iker Casillas, Victor Valdez and Oliver Kahn. On April 22, 2014, Sek was substituted in the first leg of the Champions League semi-final against Atletico Madrid with a shoulder injury. Chelsea manager Jose Mourinho stated that the injury would prevent Sek from playing again in the 2013-14 season. Despite the injury, Sek would finish the season as the joint winner of the Premier League Golden Glove Award along with Arsenal goalkeeper Wojciech Zaczesny, both keeping 16 clean sheets. Seca's place as Chelsea's starting goalkeeper was taken at the start of the season by Thibaut Courtois. This was possibly due to Seca's long-standing injury concerns to his shoulder, back and knees. On September 24, 2014, Seca made his first appearance of the season against Bolton in the third round of the League Cup, a 2-1 victory. He made his first league appearance of the season on October 5 replacing the injured Courtois in the first half of a 2-0 home win over Arsenal. His second start of the season came in the Champions League group stage victory against Slovenian side Maribor, keeping a clean sheet as Chelsea won 6-0. With Courtois injured, Sek made his first league start of the season on December 13 against Hull, keeping a clean sheet in a 2-0 win. Despite him being second choice, Mourinho stated that Sek would not be sold in the January 2015 transfer window due to third choice Mark Swartzer leaving for Leicester City. During that month, Sek made back to back starts in the Premier League against Newcastle United at home, followed by Swansea City away from home, keeping clean sheets in both wins. On March 1, 2015, Sek started in goal in the 2015 Football League Cup final against Tottenham Hotspur keeping a clean sheet in a 2-0 victory to win the trophy for the third time in his career. At Arsenal Last summer, things changed and I understood I was no longer the first choice keeper, but I felt it was not the right time for me to go. During the season it became clear that my situation would not improve and, as I know I am not at the stage of my career where I want to be on the bench, I made my decision to move on and look for new challenges. Sec via open letter on Twitter, about his situation on Chelsea and his move to Arsenal. Sec signed for Chelsea's Premier League rivals Arsenal on a four-year contract on June 29, 2015, for a fee of around £10 million. His move saw him subjected to death threats by a few Chelsea supporters. The departure of Wojciech Zaczesny to Roma on loan made Sec first-choice goalkeeper ahead of David Ospina. On August 2, Sek won his first trophy with Arsenal after beating former side Chelsea 1-0 in the 2015 FA Community Shield. A week later, he made his Premier League debut for Arsenal in a 2-0 home defeat to West Ham. On October 20, he made his first Champions League appearance for Arsenal in a 2-0 win against Bayern Munich. 
Sec recorded his 170th Premier League clean sheet in a 2-0 win against AFC Bournemouth on December 28, 2015, setting a new league record and overtaking previous record holder David James. On March 2, 2016, he was sidelined due to a calf injury while playing against Swansea. On April 2, he returned as an unused substitute against Watford and returned to the pitch on April 17 against Crystal Palace in a narrow 1-1 draw and guided Arsenal to its 500th Premier League win on April 21 against West Brom. Marking the end of his debut season with Arsenal, he was named the Premier League goalkeeper of the season by critics and platforms for winning the Golden Glove with an underperforming defence. Sec was given the captain's armband for Arsenal in their 4-3 opening day home loss to Liverpool. In September 2016, he featured for the full 90 minutes in a 3-0 rout by Arsenal of his former side Chelsea at the Emirates. On April 24, 2017, Sec played in the 2016-17 FA Cup semi-final against Manchester City at Wembley, which Arsenal won 2-1. During this season, Sec received mild criticism among Arsenal fans for his inability to play with the ball at his feet but meanwhile he had the third most clearances among all goalkeepers in Premier League with 11 which manifested his transformation into a sweeper keeper. Sec again held the captain's armband on May 10, 2017 in a 2-0 win over Southampton at the St Mary's Stadium. Sec was sidelined for the FA Cup final due to injury, but Arsenal beat Chelsea 2-1. Sec won his fifth FA Cup, and Arsenal became the most successful club in the history of the competition with 13 tournament wins. This was a final of farewells and absent friends and, if Hazard was its winner, Sec was its most unfortunate loser. He spent much of the final match of his glittering 20-year professional career turning around to retrieve the ball, starting dead-eyed into the row of green seats in front of him, having earlier made a sublime reflex save to deny Giroud. It was a cruel end. Luke Brown of Independent in review of the Europa League final. Sec was Arsenal's starting goalkeeper in the 2017 Community Shield, against his former club Chelsea, following a 1-1 draw after regulation time, Arsenal won the match in a 4-1 penalty shootout, in which neither keeper saved a spot kick. Sec then held the armband to captain Arsenal in their 4-3 opening day home win over Leicester City. On March 11, 2018, Sec became the first Premier League goalkeeper to keep 200 league clean sheets, after a match against Watford in which he saved a penalty from Troy Deeney. Sec started the season as the first choice in goal for new manager Unau Emery, but later lost his place to new signing Bernd Leno after suffering a hamstring injury during a match against Watford. On January 15, 2019, Sec announced via open letter on Twitter that he would retire at the end of the season. On May 29, he made the final appearance of his career in Arsenal's 4-1 defeat to his former club Chelsea in the 2019 UEFA Europa League final. Several media outlets described him as Arsenal's man of the match. Thank you for watching this video.